Good evening, Rutgers. My name is Tom Kalou, and I will be bringing you your Weather Watcher update and your forecast for as we head through the next few days. So let's get started. Well, we've cleared up from that intense round of thunderstorms we saw this morning. Clouds are, uh, skies are going to be clearing up as we head through tonight. So let's get to the Almanac with a high of 74 degrees today. That was actually this morning before the thunderstorms moved through. Low temperature tonight is going to get down to 56. 74 is actually below our average of where we should be for this time of year. Our average is right here around 79 degrees. So on this day in weather history, Hurricane Ginger formed and it remained a hurricane until the 5th of October. That 27-day lifespan was the longest on record for any hurricane in the North Atlantic Ocean. Well, guess what? We do have a hurricane to talk about today, and that is Hurricane Ike. It is currently sitting right here over western Cuba. It's a Category 1 with sustained winds of 75 miles per hour, but it's going to reemerge into the Gulf of Mexico. Now, that, keep in mind, that water there is very warm, so restrengthening is expected, and this actually could impact the Texas coast as a major hurricane. So please stay tuned for information on that. So for our regional high temperatures, we saw warm weather, warm high temperatures in Camden and Belmore. Belmore being our warm spot at 79 degrees, Camden at 77. Cooler spots, the more north and west you go, Sparta over at 72, Allentown also coming in at 72. So for our national satellite, you see well-defined cold front that moved through this morning, given the area of those powerful thunderstorms. But as that exits the region, our weather becomes dominated by this nice high-pressure system that's going to be moving eastward, bringing us some nice, fair, cooler weather as we head through the next few days. Now, perhaps you notice a swirl down here. Yep, this is Hurricane Ike as it begins its travels across the Gulf of Mexico. So, let's head into this afternoon and tonight. We're going to see those decreasing clouds. Low temperature is going to be around 56 degrees. As we wake up tomorrow, we'll see a temperature around 62 degrees. And tomorrow afternoon, mostly sunny and cooler. High temperature is 74 degrees. Yes, it is cooler. About 5 degrees below our average temperature. So, let's head to the extended outlook. Thursday, cooling, cooling trend continues. High of only 73 with a low that night of a brisk 52 degrees. Friday, some more clouds in the picture. A little warmer with a high of 76 and a low of 61. Now, on Saturday, we're going to be watching a warm front move through the region. Temperatures may be a little warmer, getting up to around 78, low of 65. Now, on Sunday, depending on how far ahead that warm front gets, we may actually see temperatures fairly warm and humid. Right now, we're going to go with a high of 84, but like I was saying, we could actually see it warmer than that. Well, my name is Tom Kalou. I would like to thank you for tuning in to this edition of Weather Watcher. Remember, you can find us right here on RUTV Channel 6 every 15 minutes. Or if you'd like some more information, come check out our website. We're at rutv.rockers.edu. Thank you and have a great day.